Giving birth can be one of the most stressful, not to mention painful times in a woman's life. Now imagine going through all of it in your car. Well, it happened to a Houston area woman, and tonight she's reuniting uh, the first responders who came to her baby's rescue. Jonathan Martinez joining us live in Montgomery town, uh, County tonight with a story all new at 6. Jonathan? Yeah, guys, and tonight, Fire Station 51 was all smiles. It's been several months since that baby was born, but today was an opportunity to, for that family to say thank you to the first responders who helped to bring her into this world. It's a reunion nine months in the making, but for everyone involved, well worth the wait. It was good to see everyone and kind of remember, oh, you did this, and oh, you were there for this part. You see, almost nine months is also how long it took before little Chloe Moak was finally born. And it just so happened to be with the help of these firefighters and first responders. Yeah, I've been in a fire and EMS for 26 years, and this is my first delivery. We were blessed that they were close enough that we didn't have to do it without them. The 28-year-old mom was on her way to the hospital last March, but before pulling out of her driveway, she had to call 911 for help as she was going into labor. Paramedics and firefighters with Montgomery County quickly showed up, and not long after, little Chloe was born in the back seat. Never in my wildest dreams I figured I'd be holding a little one that I delivered in the back of a Ford Explorer. Now just old enough to start walking and talking soon, for little Chloe, this day was all about meeting and greeting. The family thankful for the helping hand by the first responders who assisted in the delivery, the first responders grateful to have a new member of their family. A little Miss Chloe, they, they bring us uh, stuff to eat all the time or even just stop by the visit to see what's going on. And so we enjoy every time. That will be another good thing because she is going to definitely need some other people to look out for her. I think she's going to give us a run for our money for sure. In addition to some plaques that the first responders got for making that very special delivery, the family also presented the first responders with a very early picture of Chloe shortly after she was born. Our reporting live tonight from Montgomery County, I'm Jonathan Martinez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.